Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I'm doing what blessings coming to the sign of Taurus, and keep in mind that this will not resonate for all of you. If you like a personal reading, I'll leave that description down below. Another thing you do is we have memberships on the channel, so you go ahead and join, become a member, get access to all those members. Taurus, you know what I was about to do? I don't know why. I was about to put all your cards back in the deck. <laughs> Anyways, on the bottom of the deck for the overall energy, we have the Two of Swords. Taurus, you know what? It, it feels like you're going to be encountering someone in your life who's a bit panicky, I'd say. And, and you're, you're going to be the one that kind of helps and grounds them. Make them stop being so panicky. And stop worrying so much. And the Nine of Swords, Strength card, that is Leo Energy, Four of Wands, the Star, Aquarius Energy, the Empress, the Magician, ooh, look at all these good cards, Taurus, I see you really being able to manifest what you want, anything in your life that you want, anything that you, you're dreaming of, you're, so whether that be a relationship, I do see that being possible. Feels like you, like I said, you're gonna be attracting someone in your life where you really help bring them back to a more grounded state. Um, now let's say, if you want a home, that's possible, or a residence, you know, anything is possible for you. It's you really being able to manifest what you want in your life. So, on the bottom of this deck, we have the King of Cups, that's water energy, so you could have some water placements, or maybe someone coming towards you can have water placements. You have the Page of Swords, King of Wands, that's fire energy, Seven of Pentacles, Temperance card, Sagittarius energy, we have the Death card, Scorpio energy, Six of Cups. Okay, so... I see you letting go of a lot of things, releasing death card, but I see your life improving. Taurus, I really see you being able to get what you want in life. I can't help but express that. Like, you put energy towards something, Taurus, and you get that. I see better people coming into your life as well. I see an old friend popping back up. You got a lot of good things coming your way. Let's have a look at your extra cards. And number five, change direction with ease. This is a time for change, shape shifting your soul's evolution. It is a time to reconsider what you're wanting. You may be in for surprise. So, Taurus, that is a message for you. We have number eight with fertility, potential, powerful creative energy, initiation energy. Yes. So, for those of you. You know, it can represent actual fertility, can represent creative energy. We have Dive Deep. Forgiveness. Number 15, the Awakener. Rise. Out of the ashes I rise like the golden sun. So that's you, Taurus. You have this powerful energy about you. You're rising here. Number 27, Walking Away. So yeah, you're, a lot of you may be walking away from something or letting something go from your life. Uh, there's also a possibility for forgiveness there, but towards anything in your life that you want, you can have that. You have that ability to manifest that. All right. So, Taurus, that's all I have for you. Let me know if that resonates. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye, guys.